Hi, today in this Geometry Nodes quick tutorial, we'll know about the new way of functioning of the Viewer Node. Basically, what's going on is that the Viewer Node now shows not only the information in the spreadsheet editor, but also in the 3D Viewer. Let's compare. Please just remember that I have a playlist about the Geometry Nodes on the links in the description. Like and subscribe if it's helpful. In 3.3, if you wanted to, as an example, see what the Viewer was seeing, you will have to connect the group output to the node that you wanted to check or mute all the following nodes. Also, if you connected a field to the second input of the viewer node, you would only see the information in the spreadsheet editor and it will be hard to interpret. But in Blender 3.4, it's different. If you connect the viewer to a node, you will see the information in spreadsheet and 3D viewer. And if you connect a field to the second input of the viewer, you will see an overlay showing its information. So the data is easier to check and understand this overlay can be adjusted in the overlays before. You are also going to be able to see in which domain the information is evaluated. So as an example, if you change from auto to face, then the viewer information of the spreadsheet editor is going to move to the face domain and evaluate it that way. Also, now you just have to click on the viewer to activate or deactivate it, which makes everything faster. And if you just want to know the information on the spreadsheet editor as usual, or for some reason you want to deactivate the node in one of the viewports, you can go to view and then disable the viewer node checkbox. So tell me in the comments what do you think about this change. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and see you next time.